Get into that dank souls. <laughs> yeah, I'm on. I don't get it. I don't know why I have to. I have to do it manually. Good, 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 good. To be left in the dust. Training room, training room. There we go. Basic. Basic as fuck. I always felt that was fitting for him. The siren. Okay, who's got it? Selfie's got it. So what I'll do is I'll switch selfie with Christie's and I'll add Sleep. 
Madre.
There we go, baby. We're gonna smash. Jeez. Oh shit, it worked. Fucking awesome. It's super effective. <laughs>
summon magic. Why is it so glitchy? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you. 
That's really just a time saver.
Oh shit! <laughs> What's up, Goofy dude? Get the fuck away! Long time no see! That's insane! It's been a long time. Yeah, bro. Took me took me two months to finish Persona 5. Played it every night. I finished in 150 hours. It was worth it, totally. Plus the break, like I finally detoxed. I finally got detoxed on on, on Let It Die. <laughs> It was good. It was really good. I'm not, I don't regret it one fucking bit. It was great, great experience. Now, now I'm doing something very masochistic, which is replaying Final Fantasy VIII, because I know I'm gonna fucking suffer like halfway through. But I can't help it. I was actually gonna do Final Fantasy VII, but I was like, yeah, everybody's fucking doing that, so. <laughs> yeah. Eight is like one of my favorites. Yeah, both are amazing, it's true. Um, Problem is, Seven is so saturated because everybody's like, yo, let's play the classic before the remake comes out, you know? Remake comes out in. Four days, actually. I did stream it a few nights on my Android. Eight is really cool, though. I'm not doing the voices, though. I've heard people doing voices. I'm not doing the voices. <laughs> it's a good game, but the fucking... Oh, the leveling up system is really fucked up in this game. So it makes no sense. It's like the game rewards you for not not wanting to level up, basically. <clears throat> it's really hard to explain. What's up, man? 
I went to your room, but you weren't there. <laughs> I was thinking maybe you wanted to, you know. Oh, he really was looking for me. <laughs> So weird. You're fucking weirdo. <laughs> like, good God. Yeah. I will eventually play Seven, though. Um, the remake's so fucking good. Give me a second. Your favorite game? Why are you why you, why why are you why are you generating me like some kind of suspense? What game are you playing? <laughs> Gravity Rush. I'll probably buy both Gravity Rush games. Oh. Path of Exile. No fucking way. You're a Path of Exile head. Oh, Timber. Better fun game. Hurry. Okay. I played a lot of Path of Exile, but I'm really bad at it. Like I, bas I basically dragged my corpse along the whole game, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Like, uh, 4,000 hours? Jesus Christ. I dra <laughs> dragged my corpse. I played an archer. I mean, like, I don't remember the name of the class exactly. I'll show you one day if you want. I still have my save file. I mean, of course I, of course I do. But, um... Like, <laughs> like, uh, I'm like still like way out of my league. Every time I fight a boss, I have to die like a thousand times. So it's like not really impressive. I've seen people play it. It's like they know how to set up their characters in a way that it's it's like interesting. It's cool to watch. It's not me. I'm just dying over and over again. No, it wasn't hard. I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it and I was doing good for a while until I got to like the really far end end game part of the game. Or at least it felt like the end. And I just spent the whole fucking time dying. Like all the time. But, um, I'm sure I have some screenshots around there somewhere. I was obsessed with it because I was like, yo, this is like a free Diablo. <laughs> it was good. It was a lot of fun. But you know, it never picked up, so I just like I play something else. Three times. Oh shit. Yeah, more or less what I did. I mean, I got through the majority of it in the first run. Because I, I was very disappointed with that. Like, not to, you know, not to shit on the game or anything, but the, the whole you know respawn outside the map outside the outside the boss it's just it really fucks it up for me that's the same thing that happened with bioshock i couldn't take it seriously anymore i need a game to really like fucking persona 5 was like hitting me hard at the end we got we got to the final boss and it was like i was like whoa shit what do i do like oh my god and then like i just tweaked it a little bit like i can't exactly tell you what i did but you know what i did I just like uh, it was it was uh, it was something I was ignoring the whole game, which was the whole attack defense uh, evasion thing. And I swear to God, it was like this. Like, can you believe? Like the whole fucking game, I was doing good, and then like 99% of the game, and then uh, that last final attack fucked it up for me. So what happened? I basically had a I had one, only one item in my entire fucking backpack that made it possible for me to like um, raise my defense, my party's defense and I survived the raise of control 
and then I, I finished him off. But it, like, it made me reflect on the whole fucking game. I played the whole game wrong, basically. Like, I never paid attention. I never paid attention to defense. Never paid attention to attack buffs, to, to evasion accuracy buffs. Like, I got really, really lucky because if I had played like maybe on hard or merciless, I would have been. I would have been screwed, man. I'd still be trying to beat the game. I got so fucking lucky. Bueno, amor, entonces lo que vamos a tener que hacer es esperar. No queda otra. I was about to talk to you in Spanish. Um, this is one of the most frustrating parts in the game. I just... Uh... Oh, coffee. No fucking way. Incredible. Incredibly rewarding. I'm glad that I gave it one last try because I was about to go back and gr grind and I figured what I would do is I would get at least a persona with an enduring soul. The enduring soul skill so I could... Um... So I could survive that final attack, but um, I got lucky. I had like, I had I had one of those um, Japanese named like it was like a little item that allowed me to, you know, de raise defense for three turns, and then um, that was it. That was all I needed. So I didn't do too bad. I was really on it. I was on it. I was on it in mementos. I was on it. I was gonna do a whole review on the on the game. I, I might do it. I don't know. Like, you know, it's weird. I can't really review the game without, like, spoiling it. That's the problem. So I don't know. I really... I'm kind of divided on it right now. As for Royal, I'll probably wait a year for, like, the price to go down. Or something, you know what I mean? These fuckers. <laughs> What's the point of Royal? Well, they added a bunch of, um, it's the typical thing that uh, Atlas does. They, they wait a few years and then they re-release the game with a bunch of content. It's kind of like Kingdom Hearts Remix. So I think they added new palaces and a new character and probably an entire like short story. So my best point of reference would be um, Persona 3, which after they released it, they released Persona 3 Fez, which was like kind of like in celebration of the, of the first game. And that had an entire story based on Aegis uh, after the events of Persona 3, which is really shitty anyway. It was just a big, it was a long ass dungeon with um, a lot of hard bosses. But even then, you know, like as a hardcore fan, you feel like very appreciate, you know, you can really appreciate something like that. So I know what they're doing. They, they do it all the time. But paying full price again. Dude, $60. 60 fucking dollars? No fucking way. <laughs> I'm not paying that shit. No way. They're evil. That's evil shit right there. Same thing with like Golden. P P play, uh, Persona 4 Golden is still costs $25 to play on a PS Vita. That's the thing though, that's like their Final Fantasy. Without Persona, like Atlas doesn't really exist anymore. You know Atlas made um, Demon Souls, right? They published Demon Souls back in the day. I don't know, if, I don't think they do Dark Souls though. I don't know if they sold it off or whatever. It's basically like Konami with the Metal Gear Solid franchise. It's like it's, it's the one thing they got. They gotta, they gotta, they gotta, they gotta make it work. I hate this mission so much. I love this game, but I hate the majority of this one, which is like. They ruined it. They ruined Metal Gear Solid. Good God. Uh, Metal Gear Survive. I haven't tried it yet. 
<laughs> I bet it still costs forty dollars. I will bet you anything. Did you hear they're finally caving in and they're doing they're doing Silent Hills review? Like, Silent. I think I heard something like that. Like, first Konami like kicked like booted booted Kojima off the off the project, and then Sony like contacted Konami and they were like, "Yo, we're, we want to do Silent Hills." And we're gonna do Kojima, so it's like <laughs> full circle. That would be tight. I think they could really pull it up. I hope they don't do the the. I don't hope they, I hope they don't use Norman Reedus for it though. Wouldn't it be weird? If Norman Reedus just in everything. <laughs> I played most of them. Yeah, Silent Hill was really good back in the day. The forest of timber sure have changed. You must reply, but the owls are still around. This is a tiny example, like, this is a tiny example of this game fucking you in the ass, because, like, there's a lot of instances here that if you don't pay attention, there are, you can get totally lost. You can spend hours looking for the right place to go, or... or Yeah, you either really get fucked. It's not like the old. It's not like Persona Five was even Persona Five was like, "Yo, did you remember to fucking do that shit?" And you're like, "Oh yeah." <laughs> but this isn't like that. You'll spend. You'll you'll basically like fall off the edge of the map for the, forever. I've had to quit. I remember when I was little, I quit this game like once because I was like, I don't know where I need to go. I'm done. What? <laughs> this is a fucking remake? This is remastered. It's different. It looks like shit. <laughs> you told me it was gonna look like the other game. This looks like shit. Don't be like that, dude. Modi! Really? <whistles> Fuck, man. Oh, shit. Normally, yeah, I forgot. Normally, you talk to him to get the curse lamp and. Just ignore him. He's he's thir he's thirteen. He's thirteen years old. I told him I bought the remaster. He thought remaster meant remake. He's probably like scratching his head. He's like, why'd you pay twenty dollars for this? <laughs> Honestly, like Square Enix knows that like their hardcore fans would pay. Twenty dollars for this, but like if I was a normal dude, yeah, I probably wouldn't pay twenty bucks for this either. But um, I'm just, I'm actually really happy. Still, they really made it. Like they really fixed fucking Squall's face. I don't know if you remember on the PlayStation One, like his face was like, his he was an elephant man. Whenever the pixels like went off, what are you doing? Get it on. One of these days you're gonna grab my phone. You're you gonna see like a giant dick on the screen. <laughs> it was terrible. So good though, right? Give me a second. All right. So let's just get it out of the way. I'm gonna. I always, the first thing I do is, uh, when I get the lamp, I just go straight for the... I just go straight for the GF, so, um... Give me two seconds, I'm gonna... I don't know if you're even interested in this, but, uh, I'm gonna do it anyway. So, give me a second.
Are you scared? You'll be fine. You're young. Creo que tenés que esperar una semana para que te dé positivo. Sí, sí. ¿Qué sé yo? Sí, te lo compro. Te lo compro también. No te preocupes. Damn. Ok. ¿Estás ready? ¿Did I save? I don't remember. You should save your game before using it. <laughs> That's genius. God, they are good. That's genius. Oh. I'm trying to remember the trick for this fight. No! Oh my god! I fucked up. Yeah, you fucking I fucked up really bad. I'm just gonna wait until I die, because um, unless I get unless I get the end here, which is most likely not gonna happen. But um, yeah, I fucked up really bad. I didn't junction. I didn't junction the, the new characters. It's something I always fuck that up in this game. Come on. Seriously though, her limit break is OP. It, you can land the end, which is basically win the fight. Or Rapture. But, um, Yeah, it's instant win, but the problem is it's very rare. I'm not gonna get it. If I do, <laughs> it'll be the funniest win. You don't know how I beat this game. Like, how I beat this game is ridiculous, actually. If I get it and I skip it, I will kill myself. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Can you get it? Can you get it? What the fuck just happened?
<laughs> this is this is more exciting than watching paint dry. <laughs> Good game. Good game. <laughs> Good lord. So how'd you die? Because you stupid poopy head. Okay. Right. So let's switch Christie's to selfie. Good, good, good. Thank God. I know I can do the fight. I've done it before. Mostly, I never wait. I always do it, like, right away. One time, I even did it, like, in the in the dream sequence. When you play as Laguna. And that's fun, because I love the, I love the, the fight music. But waiting longer is a bad idea because everything in this fucking game levels up with you. So, like, the the harder you are, the harder the enemies are. Man, I wish you could have seen, dude, I wish you could have seen me fucking play Persona 5. Like, there were moments where I was like, I wish I could have streamed this. Because, like, even if I could stream it now, it's done. It's like, I already did it. Like, the magic was in my first impressions, my first, like, everything about it was just so good, you know? And that's gone now. Like, <laughs> that was very intimate. That happened... That happened off screen, you know, with me, so, which I'm grateful for. I'm actually almost thank thankful that, like, I'm almost, almost, almost grateful that that I had no choice but to play it by myself because that brought back so many like good memories of like intimacy with video games. You know what I mean? Since the fact that now, like, I need, I feel the need, almost like the urge, the the constant need to like share whatever I'm playing, but. Um, that was good. It was really, really good. Like, you should have seen it. I, I beat the fuck out of it, too. And like, Velvet Room, I maxed out. The, I basically, oh my, I almost maxed out. Like, anything below level 70, I got it. You know? I didn't go all out 100%, but, like, 
I got most of I got most of the personas. Like I was very dedicated. I was very committed. You know, just not at like inertia because I, I played three and four and I was I, I already got used to it. Not too good on the confidants though. I didn't get all of them. I'm kind of I'm kind of sad about that. I got very little maxed out. I think just three: Ryuji, uh, An, and Kawakami. Kawakami is my first one. Very useful. Very useful. Sorry, I just had to I just had to say that. I had to share that. Demi, I think he cures me. Fuck! I think that was the tricks of this fight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna look into it. Hold on. I fucking knew it. And I don't have any any life yet. Life doesn't exist. Oh. Let's see if that works. I don't know. If that works, I will fucking shit myself. Shit. <laughs> it's too good to be true. I don't have anybody with item. <laughs> that smells so good, Mate. Que si te? Fuck Zell, I don't, I don't need Zell. I get, I get beat this without him. <laughs> what? Oh, Dios. <laughs> I 
Um, I really dropped the ball, man. Good lord! I need somebody with item. doesn't work. I don't know, is it, does it work on the PS4 controller? I just said. Unless it's another button that I don't know about. It doesn't work. R1 doesn't work on this. It's pretty rough. Like I don't know what I don't know what a game wants from you, but like it's it's actually a lot easier. Thanks to Selfie. Selfie has an insane limit break. Her limit break is way too overpowered. It'd be a lot easier if Zell wasn't dead right now. <laughs> 
Guys, forgot we don't. I don't have any life in it, magic yet. So I need item. I need someone with item. With the item ability. That's my bad. I play. I play for shit. Oh, we'll be good. I think we're almost done. Drop one. Let's see if this works. At least to keep them busy. Did it work? How much damage does it take you? Not bad. Yeah, there he goes. He goes and fucking cures you. This is an old trick. It's really, really, really hard to make him draw Denny, though. See? It's one of the hardest things to draw for some reason. Fucking busy, like fuck you. <laughs> oh god, that was wonderful. Final Fantasy VIII, everybody. <laughs> that was rough. He went beast mode. I think even if I had item ability for everybody, it'd still be... It'd be a little... It'd be tough. I'm thinking like how we could make it work. Easy game. <laughs> Good god. The worst part of all is that I really like that GF. That, that Guardian Force is like very useful later on. Because it has some wicked... Some wicked fucking end game skills. Like for example, no encounters, uh, half encounter, um, the ability to steal items from enemies and shit like that. So, uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to go for it. I can't back down on that. Plus, what else am I gonna do? The main story? EU. <laughs> What I will do though is I'm gonna give somebody the ability to. I need to give somebody the ability. How much? How many Phoenix styles do I have? Four. Hardly feels like worth it when you think about it. Like the ability to draw, maybe just for this fight though. Let's say that we give it to like two people. Even then, like it's not worth it. There we go. We'll leave draw on Squall, so maybe I can get like a Demi or two. And we could like, um... Shit, motherfucker. Dude, just oh my god, dude.
It's not really hard, it's just weird. It's a weird game. That's what it is. I don't know. It's the weirdest Final Fantasy of them all. No choice. Let's just wear him down as fast as we can. Either that or I'll have to grind my I'll have to grind my GS before I fight him. Which is weird, I've never had to do it before. Got it. How many? How many? Two. Yeah, did you see that? something. We'll be fine.
He's getting nasty. Oh man. Come on. I show him. <laughs> there we go. Yay! <laughs> that was painful. Good lord. What is that thing? It's massive pig, man. No, dude. Fucking nightmare. I was thinking, like, I was gonna do some, some card capturing, but, like, because there's one card that I really want to get. And now that I've got two GF cards, I was thinking, like, maybe getting it. Let me see. Meanwhile, I can now um, I can draw. Hey, right, keep it. No. Go for it. <laughs> You're like, don't enable me. <laughs> I don't know. Such a weird game. All right, so what, what's it called? I'm trying to, when you, when you go for cards, for some reason, every once in a while, there's a rare event where you'll get a card that's not the one that you're, the monster you're capturing, it's a much rarer card. And 
I remember this from like my childhood, so I'm trying to I'm trying to replicate it. It's like shitty Pokemon. Go for it. <laughs> go, 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 go. No. They're just normal. Doesn't matter. I think now with two GF cards, I'm, I'm good enough to try to get the... Uh, the card that I want. Zell's mom, for some reason, has uh, a card of him. So... Hold on. <clears throat> I'll show you. I love that it takes the time to load, like it's actually checking some memory card, like like the old days. It's really stupid. <laughs> yeah, you ready, mama? Kick your ass. Shit. She has no idea what's coming. <laughs> These cards are trash. It's really hard too. It's like really hard to like get good. Cause like. The first few steps to like get good cards in this game are like, and yeah, not good, not good at all. This is a certified one though. For example, she has no sevens to the left, so I could totally make this one work. Do you have any seven to up? Okay. Ooh, baby, you fucked up. You fucked up good. Take this out. She lost. There's nothing she can do. Doesn't matter now. I win. This is like the nerdiest thing ever. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, bitch. Can you imagine him like in, in his ki the kitchen? Like, you bitch. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh man, King Tomboy King. That's really good. And a Marlboro. Oh, I'm not sure which I want. Which one I want though. Marlboro is a good corner card. You're gonna laugh, but I'm like. I'm, I'm very passionate about, about triple triad. <laughs> okay, so now replicate. Soon enough, you'll you'll like start finding like your best cards, which is crazy. That wasn't bad. This is actually really good. I got a bottom left corner. I've got a top left corner. I've got a bottom right corner. Now I just need like a bottom. Bottom right, that'd be perfect. But you know, we're just gonna have to play safe. You know? um, let's go with the bite bug. That's a re that red bat is really rough. That's a tough one. Um, 
Shit, I'd do like a I'd do like a full session of this. I could do that. Uh, <laughs> I'm so glad they remastered this game. For some reason, they couldn't remaster it either because it was like they lost all the files or something. It wasn't easy. Because if you paid it, if you ever notice, um, they have, let's we'll see, I the left. It's got a seven to the left, it's got a seven to the top. I'm gonna play it safe in the corner. Um, Final Fantasy Final Fantasy VIII wasn't easy to remaster. They basically had they probably had to rebuild the game. Um, unlike, or maybe like use the PC port as a as like a, I don't know like a base or something. Cause uh, it's not like seven. All all the other games had Android ports. Like like it was nothing. But um, Def, not this one. This one had like serious trouble getting out. Four, two, shit. What are we gonna do? Okay, we're gonna play the corner again. God damn it. Oh shit! Awesome. Fucking awesome. This is simple, because we're playing onesies, but like, later the rules change, shit gets wild. I'm just, I don't even, I don't know how to play anymore. This is actually a really good card. Like a, like a middle bottom. I'm gonna teach you how to be good. I'm a DJ and I play Dribble Dry. Why isn't Zell popping up? That's pissing me off. Zell would be really good. Good. There we go. You see what I mean? You, you get where I'm going, where I'm, where I'm getting at? Let's see what I'm getting at. That was a stupid move. You see, god damn it. It's like, trying to piss me off. If we were playing for multiple rewards, I'd beat the shit out of her. Come on. I'm taking this way too seriously. No, no, this minigame is really easy. You just gotta, like, pay attention to, like, what are your strong cards. There's totally skippable. Yeah. But the problem is, there's a skill later on in the game. It's called Refine, Card Refine. And you can take all of the cards you ever want in the game and you can turn them to super rare items. That They're very useful in the, in the end game. And I'm, I'm gonna make use of that later on. She's fucked. She's totally fucked. Actually, another mob war wouldn't be bad. Come on! Come on, Zell's mom! Have you improved your game, bitch? You basic bitch! You basic triple triad biatch. Don't call me a basic bitch, you fucking bitch! Dude! Where's Zell at? Sin? Whatever. I'll just come back yeah, later. Cell? Cell? Cell, see. Cell. You mean like Cell from Pokemon? From uh, Dragon Ball Z? <laughs> Cellula! Molecula! Mentira! That's not his name for real. Okay. Yeah, just own the corners. Own the corners. Play safe. 
There we go, you dumb motherfucker. Got him. Premium content, everybody. Awesome. Middle right. That's gonna be useful. Once you got like your t fucking five cards, you're unstoppable. As long as the rules don't change. You gotta be careful who you play with, because once you play with someone in another, another region, your, your rules change and then your game's fucked. But like, the first the first games are so easy. Oh, that was good. This is so good, oh my god. I'm gonna go for that Tom Berry King. Check this out. Never mind. No, no, no. Wait, wait, yeah, no. Fuck it. <laughs> I'm gonna highlight this. I'm like, this is what, this is what I, I paid twenty dollars for. Um, fine. That's good. That's good. Fine. There we go. This is big performance. Fuck, let it die. Fuck Final Fantasy VII Remake, this is what it's all about. Oh. <laughs> Seriously, and you're crazy, what the fuck are you doing watching this? I gotta be careful not to... Doesn't matter, I won. I get to talk to you while I'm playing. <laughs> All right. Um, Gala. This one's called Gala. Now I'm going for Tom Burger King, but I don't think I'm gonna use it because I already have a good top left, and that's my Diablo. We're good. I like my selection. But this bitch ain't dropping fucking Zell, dude. It drove me crazy. Come on, I know you got it. Unless they removed it from the game. Like, we got a surprise for hardcore fans. We got rid of the thing that they knew about already. Yeah, they really did, actually. I can't, I'm, I'm not seeing it. Oh shit, Bigs and Wedge, that's great. That's wonderful. That's basically gonna... No, not really, it's not that good. It sucks for homeboy, actually. I really... Never mind. I see what's going on. Doesn't have a good bottom. Yeah. Doesn't have a good top, so... Take the corner. And this is because it's open game. If you can't see the other guy's cards, that shit is scary. That shit is fucking scary. Okay, now we can take him. Bad. Top middle. Starting to piss me off, lady. One more, just one more. <gasps> uh. It's actually good. It's actually a good card. No, it's not. It's a shitty. It's a shitty ifrit. I don't need it. 
Um, if you can't hit a, something good on the bottom, that's not. Uh, let's keep it like that. There it is. Yes. Okay. I'm <laughs> so excited. Last one, and we got it good. We got it good. That's great. Okay. I gotta lure it out though, because he's got an A on the bottom. So if I pulled out Ifrit, he'd pop out the he'd pop out a fucking cell. So I'm gonna have to go hard on the top left. I'm taking this shit seriously. It's very embarrassing. There we go, you stupid motherfucker. Awesome. And he has no sevens. So just hit him with the last toy on the left, on the right. Um, and that's it. And that's all she wrote. I got way too excited just now. That's stupid. That was weird. Uh, hold on. I would not be caught dead using a fungar. Yes! Oh yeah. Super rare. There's only one in the game. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> I feel bad for myself. That is so good. Fuck you, mama. <laughs> Imagine some stranger comes to your house and demolishes you and triples right at Steals your fucking son's card. That's good. Oh shit. Why did they put this here? God damn it. <laughs> Can you imagine? Just fucking got the card and then I quit. <laughs> okay, done. Done and done. Alright, main game. Let's keep going. So good. You see this bitch right here, the Queen of Cards. I don't want to know anything. Leave me alone. Open. No, leave me alone. Slow and steady is the way to go because you see what what, what happens is if you change the regional rules for cards the game gets really hard like very very hard and it's better to do just one and open because even though the prize is only one card of a game you can make sure that you get those super rares otherwise if you play well, obviously, also never play a card game unless you save first, because if you lose, then you lose one of the cards, one of your rare cards. They always go for the rarest card you have in your deck, in your hand. And if you lose that, you're done. I mean, you can't recover from that, basically. I wanted to, I wanted to stream a Final Fantasy for so long. Give me a second. I'll be right back.
me some socks. <laughs> it's freezing down here, bro. I feel really bad because like one of my followers and like one of my my, my only subscriber right at the moment. He's been dying for me to play um for me to play Soul what's called Dark Souls. And um I went and bought this. Such an asshole. I'm gonna surprise him though. He doesn't know it yet, but I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna show up with Dark Souls eventually. Pretty cool, huh? Nobody gives a fuck. Shut up. I used to think Zell was so cool. Dude, it's fucking freezing. Give me a second. I just remember I used to have a friend who really liked the um, ASDF movie I don't know if you remember those stupid fucking shorts um, and he was like I like trains and then like all of a sudden selfies like <laughs> selfie pops up she's like I like trains and I was like oh no plus selfie's so cute she used to be annoying but I like her now maybe because I'm older I'd kill that one. <laughs> Her want to hang out with me. Squall is so lame. So, so cool. Whoa. I mean, right? Like, in retrospect, wouldn't it be fucking awesome? Look at it. I love Trey. <laughs> he wouldn't shut up about it. He was like, oh, that's so funny. She's so stupid. I don't remember if we, I think we get the Laguna flashback now. It's either now or on the way back. I'm not, I don't remember. <laughs> Pet pals. I hate the fact that you can be such an asshole. Plus, I used to I used to think it was cool. Like I played this back when I was like eleven years old. Imagine, and I used to think it was like so cool that Squall was so. Uh, I don't give a fuck about nobody. Fuck Jesus Christ. Fuck America, it's just me, my problem, you know? And now I'm like, dude, you should be, I don't know. I, I know that he has like a rough past because he's an orphan and everybody's an orphan in this game. I love that, I love that big reveal. Everybody's an orphan. <laughs> That's why they're so weird. Timber fell easily to all by you. No, that's it. <laughs> oh, jeez. Here we go. Yeah. God, this is one, like one of the the flashbacks in this game are the best. They're like the best scenes. I love playing as Laguna.
I'm going to let my hair down just for, the, just for the occasion. You okay? I actually wanted my hair long because of this character, this main character right here. What the? What are you just going on? Check it out. Tell me if I don't look exactly like him. Here he comes. <laughs> I'm getting into character. What is this? Some kind of suicide squad. <laughs> yeah. Man, my hair is popping today. <laughs> yes, so good. Kind of looks like Michael Jackson, just like me. <laughs> but he's got that long, silky hair. Mine's a little more wavy. Come on. Come on. Remember, wouldn't be caught dead with one, but I'll catch her anyway. Fuck, I killed it. Got it. How much do you remember about um, Final Fantasy VIII coffee? I mean, do you recall? Do you recall who these guys are? I doubt you'll be playing Final Fantasy VIII again. I'm just saying, you know, if you want, we can talk about it. <laughs> it's like playing it again. Um, right, so... Spoiler alert. Um, Laguna's really fucking important. I mean, he's not important to the game as much as he is important to Squall. Problem is... Japanese people, they're not really good at writing. I mean, they are, but they're not. They weren't, like, direct enough when, um, on who Laguna really is. So Laguna's like, he's Squall's dad. <laughs> he's his dad. There are hints in the game, but you basically gotta like figure it out for yourself. Like even at the end of the game, you don't really ever find out. But the tip, the the, the clues are there. They're all there.
back. Why are you so weak? That's a shitty weapon. Can you imagine being like, oh, I missed. I'll, I'm gonna go. Excuse me. So you're, at this point in the game, you're not supposed to think anything of it. You're like, what the fuck is going on? I was playing this game, it was all very confusing, and now it just got really, really confusing. And, you know, a lot of people get pissed off about that. But, uh, what's it called? Check out this exposition right here. <laughs> this is weird. It's a weird, like, hey, what is the, the fucking thing we were doing? Just that, uh... <laughs> it's a total cheese ball. Laguna's fucking. Here we go. <laughs> Water. Totally worth it. We're gonna learn mug. Basically, it turns like your normal attack into a fucking. So every time you strike an enemy, you steal. Kill two birds with a stone. Chill, man. It's cool. <laughs> How about a drink? <laughs> Yo, Laguna's the best. Fucking love the fuck out of him. Let's drink some juice. <laughs> This is great. Like, even if I wasn't streaming this, I would just, like, remarkably appreciate it. I, like, enjoy it. It's so good. Sir! <laughs> it's like, you can't fucking even say that. That's not right. It's cool. <laughs> it's like... It's so good. necessary <laughs> what's that I'm walk around <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> what? <laughs> right, okay, so... Ah! You see this option right here? Okay, so... Okay, so ever like... Oh my god, it's, it's like, I don't know. They feel, they feel Squall's presence, like his party, they feel Squall's party's presence. And they don't know why that um, Guardian forces are, are, are on their side. They have no idea. They, later on, they call it like um, their special fairies or something like that. So like, we're essentially like affecting the past. I don't know. It's part of, it's part of the whole time compression thing. I don't know. <laughs> this game is fucking... But I've never actually gotten this, uh, I've never bothered, I've never bothered on, 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 um, on asking, on, on, on selecting that twice. I'm just get. I'm just starting to realize it now. <laughs> it makes, it makes, it makes sense later on, but yeah. Is this a dream? Everything you see like that, for example? is Squall and the guys they're um, thinking while living this like moment in the past it's very crazy the good is pretty good. that's selfie right there obviously I'm so glad. I'm so glad I went for eight instead of seven. I don't know. It's like I, uh, I always, I always managed to entertain myself somehow. The usual. <laughs> it's actually really cute, though. Like I will cry. I will cry many times. This game is so good. Every Final Fantasy is like undoubtedly uh, like remarkable. I love it so much. Yeah, go for it. This guy serious? <laughs> they can even hear inside of his head. Like this is really tough writing if you think about it. Like they really, they really went out on the limb here. I'm not sure a lot of people would have like. I'm not sure a lot of people like really got that here. But there's like three. There's like three levels. There's like three or four levels of dialogue here. You have dialogue like voiced. Then you have like within parentheses, which is his mind, and then like whatever's in parentheses with the with the text like faded out. That's that's whatever the, the your main party is thinking. It's insane. It's absolutely insane. It's un it's unheard of. Ah! <laughs> it's fucking it's fucking leg cramps. <laughs> that's that's what happens that's a premature ejaculation right there sad it's not sad it's just it's just confusing like even for me when I was little I was like I, I don't remember understanding any of this or, what, or, or the meaning of anything I can't 
can't bother Julia. I can't bother Julia right here. <laughs> Good work, Laguna. <laughs> Mission successful. <laughs> Oh yeah, hold on, time out. Going when he just mentioned he just mentioned the popularity thing. I totally saw the ending coming for Persona Five, uh, copy. But I still teared up. It was so good. Like when everybody was just like, "What the fuck?" And then the fucking Mishima was like, "Yeah!" <laughs> Plus, because Mishima was like the second person that I maxed out, so I got like really emotional. I was like, whoa, man, this is crazy. I really enjoyed it. God, I'm gonna, I'm, what's worse is I got so used to playing it that this morning I woke up and I was like going to sit down for my usual, my routine Persona 5 and I remembered I finished it. So I was like, damn, this is rough. Like, God damn it. I played it for so long now. It felt kind of harsh. But you cut a pretty pitiful figure up there. I'd say you're about a minus three on the manliness scale. <laughs> you're like B5. Every time you talk about it. I know, I'm sorry. It's just in I'm still in I'm still in play I'm still in Persona 5 right now. It's like everything it affected even my like personal relationships. Every time, every time I play a Persona game, like, like it affects my life so drastically. It's very cool. I, I, when I played Persona 3 for the first time, I actually went out and made friends. <laughs> I swear to God, that's how hard it hit me. How hard that game hit me. Like that was like powerful. Um, obviously, you know, Persona 5 isn't so much about the confidence as much as is, as it is about, like, you know, the storyline and shit. Which I'm glad. I'm glad that they put everything, like, they dropped, like, a, I don't know how to say it. It didn't feel as, like, impactful everything as it, as it should have, obviously, because we're all so used to it at this point. But just like I was telling my bro, he's like, "Dude, you've been playing this game for like two months." And I'm like, "Yo, I've been playing. I've been waiting for this game for like five years." So, you know, like two months is like nothing for me, you know. So whatever. Anyway, <laughs> we're done. <laughs> we're done with that. Sigh. Oh man. <laughs> this is so tight. This shit really helped with my imagination though when I was little because I remember every character had a voice in my head. You know, like for example, with Persona 5 it's different. Oh well, god damn it! Shut up, never mind, shut up. We're done. <laughs> what are you doing, kids? Go ahead. Well, I was gonna say, you know, like what I do like, for example, little, t little things were like. You know, when, like, for example, like, they would say, like, a dialogue, and they'd be like, you know, for real? You know, like, for you, geez, like, for real? You know, and then, like, you would remember, I would, like, remember their voices so well that then I could just, like, hear the rest of the dialogue in the game, like, in my mind, you know, like, the dubbing. I would dub, I would dub it myself. But this is different. You had to, you had to, like, make a voice for every character in your mind. It's really cool. Like, uh, it's weird. It's weird how, like, how like the absence of things back in the day like made for like more personal experiences. 
<laughs> What's this guy thinking? She's like, yeah, bitch, I'm hot. <laughs> it's like you're reading a book. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have this like very awesome memory of me playing Final Fantasy VIII when I was little, very little. And my mom comes in. She's like, "What? Are you okay?" It's like, "Why?" It's like, "Cause it's very quiet in here." <laughs> like, I'm just playing the game, and she looks at the game for a while. She's like, "Can't see what my my son's playing." I'm just reading dialogue off of the screen. She's like, "Are you reading?" Yeah. But isn't that boring? I'm like, no. <laughs> this is good. I'm good, mom. Thank you. You can leave now. <laughs> Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Sorry, I just want to smash. <clears throat> Dude, she is so awesome. Like, she knows he's into her. And she's obviously into him. But he's a total, like, cornball. It's so cute. I'm gonna cry. Ah. <laughs> Look at everybody. Everybody's standing around. They're, like, checking out. Everybody's crazy about Julia. Of course I do, yeah. Squall's mom. Come on. Let's go for it. Go <laughs> How weird is that? Just go like, hey, can can you tell me what Julia's room is? This is a dream. This is a dream. I wonder if they can feel what he's feeling, because that'd be weird. It's like, feel your dad's nut as he's inseminating your mother. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Japanese people. So cool. <laughs> See, oh yeah. It's like, oh yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Wants to talk. He talks to himself too much. Look who's talking. Get it together, Laguna. <laughs> so what I love is everybody's so salty. They're like, why is this motherfucker? Pretty full for just a grunt. Julia this, Julia that, yeah, I'll fix you. Send you off to a war a million miles away. <laughs> But Julia chose you. Why? Why must it always be like this? Everybody's drunk, fucking pissed off. They don't get this match with Julia. That's why it's Final Fantasy. Because this is exactly what we would all want. That's like my specialty. <laughs> Good lord. Which is Julia's room? Which? <laughs> That's so tight. Alright, show me that tag. Thanks for coming. Laguna fucking smash, bro. She's laughing. She's like, oh, yeah. Going so soon? We haven't even talked yet. It's not bad. So 
that's how you can see it, yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm not going to pluck on Amita, I just want to talk gazing into those eyes. I don't remember her being so fucking assertive. That's incredible. I must be dreaming. <laughs> oh god, he's doing it. He's doing that thing where he talks and talks. But I think she's totally into it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's already loosened up. <laughs> That's the fucking song. That is so good. Oh, dude. wake up and what the fuck <laughs> I still can't believe I dream for example the dreams we have like it's like what really right so now they come to the realization that they shared a dream together hold on I'll be right back Hmm. <laughs> 
what a relief. I had such a nice dream. I love how everybody describes it too right now. Man, I think too. It wasn't nice though. <laughs> <laughs> I dreamt I was a moron. <laughs> Sir Laguna was so cool. What? <laughs> mm. That's it. That's it. <laughs> You just shared a fucking dream between three people and you're just gonna brush it off. <laughs> the princess. That's so good. I'm trying to remember who I can get a card from on this train, by the way.
Let me just check. El adorno. Oh, yeah. Ya terminé. I think this guy right here. Doesn't really matter at this point. Open rule, yes. Seven on his ass. Yep. Come on, bro. Come at me, bro. I look it up. What? I know. He's, this guy's got the card. I remember. I'm not crazy. I just gotta keep challenging him. This is that kind of shit drives me crazy though. For real. I mean, it's an insane level of, like, insanity.
There he is. Doga. Still gotta be careful. I'm so proud of this community. I know what it was. Take care, coffee. <laughs> Take care, bro. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Thank you. 